Hello everybody, Tangible Goddess tuning in with you today. Blessings to all my kings and queens, Grim rising all day, every day. What does the universe want to tell us today regarding Sagittarius? I'm doing my Zodiac series readings today, guys. So I'm down to Sagittarius. I got what? Three more after this to go, so I'm a little bit, a little get a little crazy. And if it's after midnight, if y'all know, it's not after midnight yet. But you know, I get a little crazy after midnight, so vibe with me, guys. I love you. Blessings. Welcome to all my new subscribers, my current subscribers. I love you guys. I wish I could just hug you guys. Okay, Sagittarius. Let's get this popping just a little bit. Information, sage, cleansing. The air and energy in here is beautiful. Okay, Sagittarius. Um, Sagittarius and Tarot is the temperance card. Beautiful temperance, beautiful balance. Yes, Sag. Yes, temperance. And uh, Sagittarius is ruled by Jupiter. Jupiter. Luck. Lucky. Jupiter, okay, and it's also a fire sign. Yes, Sagittarius is a fire sign, and here we have the beautiful Sagittarius Centrium. Half man, half horse, half woman, half horse. Take it as it resonates, please. Sagittarius, let's get this reading popping. Uh, things to consider, Sagittarius. What things do you need to consider? We're gonna find out. Uh, just a little bit of extra information about the Sagittarius. Sagittarius is very optimistic, uh, philosophy, like a philosopher, very intelligent, enthusiastic, independent, footloose, and fancy free. Yes. Footloose and fancy free, Sagittarius. I love it. I love it. Okay. Let's see what you need to consider. Excited for you, Dr. Grant. Interesting, interesting, Dr. Grant. Let's see what this means. It looks like there's a man. He's out in the forest and he has a sack. He's probably collecting herbs or something. We shall see. We shall see. Dr. Grant. Just. Put that there. I know you can't really see it, but we're going to put it there anyway so that good energy can come out there. Angels and ancestors out there. We're going to get that good energy out there. Dr. Grant, let's see. Sag, what do you need to consider? Dr. Grant, I love it. This is a major Aquania card, which is the elder. So we can see this is, these cards are special. I love when the uh, cornea cards come out. They're very special. Um, it says, Dr. Grant is shown in solitude picking herbs and roots in the swamp of Louisiana. So he is getting herbs as a doctor. So you understand that herbs are the cure to everything. Everything that grows in nature has a cure. Medicines, blah. You get from the doctors, blah. I say use them when it's an emergency, but make sure that you're getting the things from earth that's meant for you to have. Yes, Sagittarius, good message for you. Things you need to consider is, do you understand the importance of alone time? Do you? Maybe it would be better to stay home tonight, Sag. Sag likes to go, travel, they're about travel too. Silence is golden. Focus on finding out the truth. Be in the world, not of it. So you're in the world, but you don't have to be of the world. You're a spiritual being, okay? Pay more attention to your guru or spiritual counselor. Yes. Did you really consider the advice you receive about that issue? Perhaps this. It's okay to take a break from him, her, them, or that to reevaluate things. It's okay to take a break, Sagittarius. Meditate more. You know what meditation is. Focusing on one thing, uh, 
being a fire sign, you might have rapid, rapid, rapid thoughts about everything. Focus on one thing, Sag. Meditate more. Follow your inner voice, your inner intuition. Beautiful message for Sagittarius. Those are the things that you need to consider. I hope you're listening. If not, rewind. You can play this video over and over and over and over again until you get it right. Dr. Grant, remember those herbs. Sagittarius, thank you for tuning in. I love you guys. Blessings to all my kings and queens. Grand rising all day, every day. Peace.